guys welcome back to cyberpunk we have been wrapping up some more site missions we don't have too much stuff left now i'm gonna neglect the gigs because apparently there's so many of those i will never be done with the game i'm gonna do the panam quest now my plan for after that is going the judy road because i love her and then we can focus on the actual main stories we are here now in the aldecaldos camp and we are supposed to talk to panam mitch and soul let's do that hey. hello you're here hi what is she doing here? I forbade you from even breathing on that Militech convoy, so you call in your friend? To do it all behind my back? Is that it? Uh-huh. That's exactly why I had V come and stand right You really think you can forbid Pan Am from doing anything? Trust me. No point. She'll do whatever she wants. No, she won't. Not if she plans to stay in this family. Damn it to hell, Saul. Are you seriously considering letting that basilisk slip through our fingers? I am. But a chance like this. A chance of what? Rotting up the job we came here to do? Get the sense this fight's grown stale. Come on, put some feeling into it. No. This discussion ended long ago. The Biotechnica people will be here in an hour. Try not to cock anything else up before then. I can't believe it. Look, there he goes, off to paint the grass green. Thought the Biotechnica job was a bust. Thought the Biotechnica contracted withered and died. Saul insists we see it through to the end. To prove the Aldecaldos keep their word. Crop protection? Who gives a damn about crop protection? All Saul is going to prove is that a corp can walk all over us. And we'll say thank you and ask for more. What's this about a basilisk? What's this basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer. Junk from back in 2060 or so. They want to pedal it off to a backwards country, somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder. The Militech convoy will take the 101 right Stop past Stop moving! This. Shame not to say hello. Let me guess, your idea. Let me guess, whole thing's your idea? How did you know? So I wouldn't be quite so pissed if it weren't. <laughs> I believe V is right. If this had been Saul's idea, he would have seen it as the greatest plan on God's green earth. <laughs> Bull, Saul isn't that petty. He's simply a coward. He would rather play it safe, bide his time. Well, if you're the leader of a family, it kind of makes sense to make sure everything is safe. It's a responsible thing to do, not cowardly. This basilisk worth another fight with Saul. Yes, a craft like that would finally put us back on the right path. The family is falling apart. If we fall into this biotechnica rut, no one will ever take us seriously again. Okay, so you do want to go behind Saul's back. Drag me here specifically for that. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. Remember when you told me to give you a good kick in the pants? Remember, a while back, told me to give you a solid kick in the pants if I saw you diving in the stupid pool again. I do, yet that was before our tandem raid on the Raffin camp. I believe you lost your opportunity there. Nope, different that. Rescue mission, someone from the family. No, you're out to plain trick him. If you plan to lecture me, you can damn well go right now. Basilisk, what's Saul's problem with it? Why Saul got his briefs in a bunch over this basilisk? He's afraid Militech will destroy us if we pick a fight with it. He thinks it's safer to stick with the corporations, like Biotechnica. <laughs> what a joke. And you guys would rather... We would rather go back to plying the trade we know best. Logistics. Meaning smuggling. That's what I said. Thought you and Saul were getting along. Thought you and Saul had agreed to bury your carbines. So did I. But it seems that's only true when somebody is trying to kill us. Exactly. You saved his life. You want to fuck things up all over again now? I saved his life. Yet somehow he still ignores everything I say. So I do believe we have come full circle. And you plan to grab the basilisk how? Thanks, V. Haven't said I'd help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. All right. Hi, Prime. Just finished Banam Quest. I loved it. Nice. Hi, Mickey. Hello. Hi, Devendor. I'm good. How are you doing? So, just the four vets on board with the plan. Nobody else. We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk someone would take it to Saul. Besides, only the vets understand what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. 
On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, we'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. Why should this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? Hmm. We'll make better use of it right here in America. Uh, I have done all the geeks in Dogtown. At least all the ones that I could find. Did you try to get Saul on board again? No luck, huh? No. Okay, everyone listen. Militech will transport the Basilisk in parts distributed across two trucks. Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck you! <laughs> the convoy will halt at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? Nice job, Panem's Sunshine. gotta beef with Saul, I know, mm -hmm. but you guys? Panem's yeah. gotta beef with Saul, I know, but... You guys? A few years back? Nobody would have given Corporal work a second thought. We want a good name. We just need good gear and good jobs. And Saul would see that if he pulled his head out of his caboose once in a while. <laughs> okay, I'm in. Okay, I'm in. Hmm. Okay, thanks. First, we'll ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? Uh, we'll we'll meet there. Meet you there. Not a problem. Come on, hey, Doc, let's go. Forward, you're welcome in. Attention, Charter Hill residents. A recent study commissioned. Hi, Gargan. I think I heard a little shake in Liz? that voice. Liz God. You did not. Ah, uh, come on. Did you get your hands? Liz got this kind of build. Clammy too. Screw you. Can I not fast travel? But are you sure you didn't Wait for the tracks? nomads? Militech won't know. I cannot. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even asked. <laughs> and y'all complain about my driving. <laughs> Have you considered it's just the game? Um Why can I not fast travel here? Unavailable in Northern Badlands? Why? Why is it unavailable? It makes no sense. Are you kidding me? <sighs> and I also cannot call my ride. Oh, great. Go to the train station. Beautiful. Maybe now it's available? I think now it's available. I just had to watch them go. Ah, okay, cool. So is anything close by? Yeah, this one. Hi, Jet. Welcome in. Hi, Potato. Welcome in. Uh, all right. Do we have something that is a bit more suitable for off-road stuff? Where's my roach? Is that roach? Roach, that you? Yeah, that's my roach. I've never rode this one in the desert. Let's see how it goes. Already there. Go to the train station. Here we are. Hello. Wow, that was a very abrupt start. <laughs> They're stopping a bit too abrupt. <laughs> Looks a bit funky. <laughs> I think they don't expect you to actually be here and do this, like. But you, I think you're expected to drive with them. 
Hello, V. Hi. Are we ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Okay. The Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will stop it at the railroad crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. V, any questions? Plan to move the engine how? Plan to move this thing how exactly? It's old tech. Carol will have to hack it. Then I'll somehow have to finagle authorization from the control tower to move it. Tower looks inactive to me too. Now we'll see to that. You and Pan Am <laughs> just get the authorization code. Okay, let's get to work. All right, discuss the plan with the nomads. Is it done? Cool, cool. Do you have anything interesting in here? Huh, that was quick. Eddies, let's go. Bam. More eddies, nice. I like me some eddies. What's this? Counterfeit documents. Hmm. The stairs it is then. Alright. I'm enjoying the game, I love the game. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well done. Thanks, boys. I can connect staff here, nice. Rembai, thank you very much. No, Rembylos, thank you very much for the first time sub on my channel. Enjoy the emotes. Welcome. Let's see if we can link them. Yeah, that that looks pretty good. Nice, actually. If I can make it work, that is. FFIC5555. Perfect. Wow. Cool. Give me the Maddies. All right. Kobe, thank you very much for the prime sub. Guys, thank you so much. I've always been fond of trains. And the stations where so I many like tracks trains. converge. Hmm. Junctions. Mm. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel free. Like you could set off on a thousand journeys all at once. Perhaps more simply, hopeful. Okay, here we are. Talk to the no- oops. Carol! What are we looking for? I didn't see the side quest that I could talk to the nomads. Punch cards. Punch cards! Punch cards. Huh? Hmm? Nothing here. Okay, find a punch card. A what now? Hmm. Oh, well, well. Okay, we found one. And then where you at? Okay, it must be here. Got something. Good job. Can I get a cookie now? I'd like a cookie. With Carol! chocolate chips. We have a card! What now? You have to put it in the reader! Well, V? The card. In the reader? Gotcha, ma'am. Here goes nothing. It worked! Come look! Hell yeah. I'm come looking. Little engine that could. Oh, that's a nasty scar. Joni enjoying the view? Yeah? I wanted to speak with you. We're speaking as we speak. <laughs> what do you want to talk about? Starting to have doubts? What do you want to talk about? What do you want to talk about? I know this may sound foolish, because I asked you to help me. But... Why are you doing this? No, it's important to you, not doing it for free. What, trust issues again? Because it's important to you? Because it's important to you. But is that all? I... Sorry, that sounded worse than I intended. Any more questions? Mm. No, 
I know everything I need to, I believe. Perhaps I should send Rogue flowers to thank her for introducing us. Hmm, not really your style, don't think. I would add a card. Thank you for giving me a true friend, you manipulative whore. That's my girl. <laughs> All right, let's rejoin the others. All right. I just wanted to give you a heartfelt thank you for all the work you put into your streaming and YouTube channels. It's an amazing weekend. Thank you so much, Capital H. Thank you. Appreciate Convoy. the kind words. Got eyes and ears on it? Hope you're doing good. Yes. Carol checks their communication channels from time to time. Everything is proceeding as planned. For now. For now. Get my, my guns ready. <laughs> I love all the Mad Max high stuff in Panem's branches. <laughs> Hi, Turin. Hi, Chris. Saul? Do you know where Panem is? I don't want to lie to him. I'm just going to ignore it. I'm keeping him on read. <laughs> red. Sorry, red. How much you completed so far? Can I see that somewhere? You have earned a rep in the Merc world and respect on the streets, but it's still not enough. Only a few ever achieve legend status in the city. Those who reach beyond their limits to achieve the impossible. The Oath. Pledged yourself to stale national ideals? Talk about cliché. Not to mention old-fashioned. You have your own reasons to act. Now is not the time to be playing someone's puppet. Your time's far too valuable, and you both know it. Dying in the service of some NUS politica? Uh, yeah, thanks, but no thanks. Running on fumes. You're operating a pure willpower now. To give up at the moment would be to give up completely. But surrendering just isn't in your DNA. Not in Johnny's either. That's for damn sure. Keep pushing forward. Everything is still within reach. I don't know. Is that, does that say how much progression that is? It, it did send, say something about percents. Hi, Flip. We could still Sit your ass down a minute, honey. I'm free. Everything's under control. The convoy is already heading our way. Worried about Saul? Does the game have alternate endings? Yes. We have quite some time left till dusk. <laughs> the car could use another one so far. I thought we were gonna sit here and spend some time by the fire. The stars have emerged. We've got a few hours till dawn. What you staring at, huh? You're acting spooked. As if you're the first person ever to stand up to Saul. Ah, oh, save your breath. I don't need to be consoled. Ah, was it someone I know? New. No. Scorpion. He came home from the war, head full of new ideas, and a host of new contacts. He tried to get Saul to lead us in joining Snake Nation. It would make us stronger, he said. I don't think he peeped a word of it to me. What did Saul do? Saul dressed the guy down head to toe for messing with the family. Hell, he didn't send him on any jobs for a year. Gee, really consoling. Thanks. You said yourself you didn't need any. Hmm. Fair point. That's strange, to Scorpion. How to raise a glass to Scorpion. To Scorpion. Demas, thanks for the two-month resub. Thank you. All right, what now? Don't talk about the war much. What's there to say? They just packed you into a panzer down in Mexico and said full speed ahead, soldier. And it was weeks talking either to yourself or the onboard AI. 
drinking iodide like water because your Geiger wouldn't shut up. Mm-hmm. I'm sprouting a rash on my ass just thinking about sitting in that boiling hot coffin. Uh-huh. But y'all can't wait to pack your asses into the basilisk, huh? <laughs> That's different. Completely different. You'll see once you're on board. I think I'll try and get some shed eye. Gonna try and get some sleep. Okay. It'll be quite some time before the convoy comes through. Wake me up if anything happens. Can tell you won't be getting any sleep. Wake me up if anything happens. Anything happens, wake me up. Unless you want a nap too. I'll just lie here a while, by your side, gazing at the stars. That another area of your expertise? What stars? Got maps is of the heavens in your library too. Of course, that's the Big Dipper. And do you see the small flickering star to the right? Yeah. You do? Oh dear, that means there's a major leak. I love how she sees stars in the clouds. Some x-ray vision or something. Is level 50 still the max? It's 60 now, okay. Okay, here they come. Is everyone ready? Let's ride, V. Let's go. That must be the cleanest spot of sleep that I've seen in this game so far. <laughs> Get in the vehicle, which one? This one? Yeah, okay. Can I shoot stuff? I would like to shoot things. Let's go! <clears throat> All right, she's moving. Get her up to speed. So, what am I doing? Follow the train, okay? Me. Uncouple one of the cars. It'll speed you up. Wait, no coming in falling. Take out that couple. Gosh dang it. What am I taking out? We're getting close. This is slow. Hey, shoot up the damn coupler. A coupler. I didn't hear you, love. I'm sorry. Surround them as soon as they're cut off. Can I hack them? Oh, hold it steady. Shit. Hurry up! Uh, go, go, go! Hey, Aries. Someone take that position! Plan, boss. All right, the train's leaving. You'd better move. Hmm. All right, I'm coming. Whee! 
How was the workout, Kwame? Okay, let's go. Ready to roll. Let's go the trucks to the no man camp. Let's go. That was fun. Okay. Fuck, it worked! Of course it did! Just as I said it would! Don't get over your head. And am. We're not done yet. How's it going there, V? Did you have fun? Sure did. Just be happy you won't be around to put the hunger chunk together. The real fun is just starting with Mitch and Teddy. Uh, okay. Let's skip the right. I can talk to him if you want. No, thank you. I'll take care of this myself. Oh god. Oh god. I have a bad feeling. She's gonna get a lecture, isn't she? Meet with Saul? Why do I have to go? Oh, there he is. There he goes. So it begins. Oh, yeah. It's coming. Oh, Lord. Hey, Salva. What's the meaning of this? Exactly what you see. The basilisk. All I see is two trucks with giant Militech logos on them. Fuck, Pan Am! You can see them from miles away! You think we don't have problems enough on our hands? The Raffins could rear their heads at any moment. And now we have Militech to worry about, too. Stop it! Fuck! Just shut up already! Jesus, woman. Do you want to serve corporations forever? Fine. Go right ahead. In that case, we'll leave the Basilisk as a souvenir of what this family used to be. Or you know what? Maybe next time we're attacked, we'll be able to fight back! As soon as I'm done with Biotechnica, we call a family meeting to discuss this. Discuss you. Until that time, I want these trucks out of my sight. And the Basilisk? Can we put it together? Do what you want. Just get out of my sight. Bob, Mitch, you two take the trucks around back. We need to unload. Sure, but then what do we do with them? Oh, I've got an idea. <laughs> she had a little mental breakdown, didn't she? Some lungs you got. Got quite a pair of lungs there. Thanks. I believe the last time I pulled something like that, I was ten years old. Uh huh. Seems still to be in fine working order. Everything okay? Yes, of course. <laughs> Though the great train robbery bit of this was much more enjoyable. It's all Angie. It's all always Angie. Well, he is responsible for an entire camp, right? Well, I don't know what she tries to do. Prove herself? What's gotten into you? You need me again. All you gotta do is call. V. Yeah. I'm sure I will. So you'd better expect that call. Uh-huh. I will. Be waiting. Take care. With a little help from my friends. Rachel. Nicely done. Eddie should have learned your account. See, you're already making friends in high places. Ugh. All right. I'm gonna fast travel out of here, I guess. Queen of the highway. What's this? Leave the camp and wait a day until the basilisk is ready. Okay, can I just like run over there, wait a day, and then get a call from Panem? <laughs> Hi, regular duck. Hello. How's it going? It's going good. How are you doing? This is outside of the camp, right? Let's just wait for a day. Unavailable candle skip time right now. Why not? How far away do I need to be to be able to skip time? Do I have to be like really far away? Aha. I'm Panem annoying. I ended up not going on the raid to rescue Saul because of the DLC. Then I get a message from Panem saying that Saul died. Really? Oof. Do we have to wait another day?
Mikado, the message, the response for the drop for the command drops is just above you. <laughs> okay, I'm going into camp, fast traveling away, waiting then somewhere in the city, and then I fast travel back. Okay. Okay. I thought just literally leaving the camp would be enough. But apparently not. Maybe I can go here. Old turbines. I don't think I can even do anything with her now. Hmm, maybe not, yeah. I didn't know he can die. Harry, thank you very much for the first time sub on my channel. Mitch. B, the basilisk. It's ready. Okay, cool. Would you like to drive it? Sure thing. Sure. Be there soon. Fuck me. It is awesome. So I hear. And what's with Mitch? Ooh, what do you think? Ain't she just a beauty? Drop by the cam stalls. Don't do her justice. And maybe you cheer up in them. Why is she sad? We are at a point where we wish Liz went the male V. Well, you can do that. I really like the female voice actor and or actress, and I really like Judy. So. Just a little more time. Yeah, yeah. You turn it into a goddamn. Rock. Ready? All ready to go. Hey, V. No, not yet. Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the systems. Mm-hmm. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss. No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the Raffin camp. Which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Fuck, made it look like he just came back from a Corpo war tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. And so, what about him? Nothing, for now. We're staying out of each other's hair. So he's not planning a family council? Of course he is. He just wants to keep me in the dark a while longer. Always wanted to take one of these for a Always spin. Always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which hmm. is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. Hmm. They just showed you the tech. Come on, hop in. Everything is set. Okay, okay. I... Why can I not double jump? <laughs> Ugh. Right. How do I get in? There. Well, that's a tiny space. The booty is descending. Hi, Burn. Welcome in. What do you mean? All right. Let's fire her up. Hold on to your head. Well, you were driving? Aww, man. Okay. I don't see that much, to be honest. Damn it. Anybody get around the earlier? Got a bad feeling about this. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything gotta... is dandy. Give me a moment. All right, man. You really like her, yeah, guys? She's bossing you oh, around, she's bitchy, yes. and she has tantrums like a child. <laughs> yes, she looks good, but... It's not the latest model, but Mitch and Bob did what they could. What is there not to like? What I do you know. think? Imagine your girlfriend would scream at you like she did at Saul. Now I get why they call them coffins. So, what do you think? Impressive, well, huh? At least now I know why people call them coffins. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What? No knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. 
It's like a mystical oneness. Ever fly something like this? Ever piloted anything like this? No. Why? Don't you trust me? Can I still get out? <laughs> no. <laughs> then I trust you. Oh, if it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support? I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay. Okay. If you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. Oh, it's so bright outside. It's oddly pleasant. You'll see. Pop, thank you very much for the first time sub on my channel. Enjoy the emotes. I feel like my HUD is a bit distorted. Okay. This will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Doesn't okay. need two pilots? You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Check in, sure. Did she do the new ending yet? Uh, no. I'm Can just I in the middle. Is this, uh, as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See? Okay. Starting to understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. Accelerate. Just put it through a few turns. Straight left and right. Am I hovering? Soft right. Same as a boat. Mm -hmm. She'll fly right over any bumps. All types of terrain. That All right, I can see you've grown bored. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. All right. Okay, let's go. Drive po past the wind turbines. Okay. I guess right. Right. So predictable. Yes, that's the way to do it. Super hard. <laughs> right. Excellent. Excellent. Now let's do some shooting. Stop and I'll activate the system. Shooting, shooting. Yes. What's on the menu? Don't get excited. Oh. The Basilisk is a cargo ship by design. But it okay. should still be a good time. All right, blast those wrecks. They're better than dirt now. Sad. Okay, practice is over. Aww. Good, now I'm going to connect. It could feel strange. Meaning? Basilisk pilots have to be fully synchronized. That means our nervous systems will be linked. Okay. It's as if you booked a room with two beds, but got a double bed with a blanket wide enough for half. What? Know exactly what you mean. Know exactly what you mean. Hmm? Tell you later. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's try this. Okay, let's try this. Guess I'll get to know you better than I'd planned. All right. Let me just say, it can be difficult at first. You'll experience feedback, sensory echoes as our systems overlap. Probably comes naturally in combat. Mm-hmm. Right. Starting now. Extra fast. I can ride over, over everything, right? So I can literally just go there real quick. And the cautious guy was right. Who would have thought it? Okay. 
Okay, V. Let's get to it. One more, there. Is everything? Yes, you turned them to dust. Congratulations. It's time to talk. Turn to the nomad camp. Uh, am I not right at the nomad camp? Or I need to go here, exactly. Right here. Okay, gotcha. Best quest for male V. I know what you're all talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You kinky, horny guys. Did you guys drop anything good or. It's a good shot. Hell yeah. Mm. No eddies? That's a lot of bodies. Uh, level tier one item components. Skill shark. Uh, nice. All right. Okay. Well, I, many things will have to change. Yes, and to start with, we need to leave this place quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course, I will prepare our route. Congratulations. Terrible choice. I voted nay. Thank you. Thanks. I need to cool down, I think. Will you come with me? All right. <laughs> what do you mean? Lucky Rocky, thank you for the two gifted subs. Enjoy the sniper rifle. An interesting day. I feel as if I barely evaded a rapidly approaching train. It's pretty close. Oh, my relic is I don't is know going. if I could have done it without you. Gong. <laughs> Come on. Shit! No, I'm Did serious. Did you see the Basilisk in action? We all owe you. It blasted them into You can me. count on the Aldecados. Ah. No squirming. Always. Lie still, I need to examine. Good to know. They won't dare show their faces again. How many did we drop? Our lord. That's what Nobody's I behind the bar. They could have been That lower. I like. That Basilisk could come around sooner. Pan Am missing from camp at such a critical moment. I have some explaining to do. What is Beer? To Lemonade? Beer. Beer me. Leave her alone. Beer me. Beer well you. Done. Beer us together. To happy endings. I think I'm gonna miss our escapades. Know where we're going now? What now, boss? I have no idea. I'm serious. Not the faintest. Turns out Saul's all right. So it's all wrong? I'll play it by ear. V, look around. Look at them. They could be your family. Panem, what do you... Stay in camp. Join us. It's not that simple. It's really not that simple. You either want to or not. What's so complicated? That's the problem. What I want right now doesn't mean a thing. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. I just thought, eh, forget about it.
Let me know when you move camp. Maybe once you move camp, we'll... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. V? Yes? What you put in that Come beer? <laughs> I... V, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? Where are we? I want to attend. What happened? What happened? I, I remember I... We were talking, then suddenly... You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Where? Somewhere new. We moved camp. Don't worry, we are safe here. For now. Oh, V. What? I took one sip of beer. V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. Blood? What's wrong? It's nothing. It's getting worse, Panem. Panem, I... It's getting worse. Every single day. Okay, B, relax. Take it bit by bit. What is happening, exactly? I'm afraid to tell you the truth. Ah, to tell you the whole truth, I'm afraid things won't be the same between us if I do. V, cut the crap and tell me what's going on. I'm worried. You know Johnny Silverhand? It's the bust attack in my head. Okay, so... You ever hear of the relic? The Arasaka tech? Does something with personalities? I saw the ads. Sounds like some rich people scam, to be honest. It's not bullshit. I've got a biochip in my head with one of those constructs. And the chip's damaged. So take it out! More complicated than that relic's also keeping me alive. The personality construct attacked my brain. Chip held a personality construct. Construct attacked my brain. You can't reverse it somehow? Stop it? Fuck, you can't get it out of your head? That's what I'm trying to do. But the clock's ticking, getting worse by the day. Fuck. Just trying to live with it. Survive, actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. Nope. I gotta go. Feeling better. Really. Wait. I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Hi, Mitch. Mitch. <laughs> Finally. We were worried. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay? Final thanks to you already settled in here. So you made yourselves at home already. We do have some experience in this. <laughs> this is no a good meds. place. We have greater control over the area. The rest will settle in quickly. I'll find out, thanks. Much better now. Thanks for your help. I'm glad to hear it. Uh, Violent J, thank you very much for the first time sub on my channel. Enjoy the emotes. Uh, I can't stay. I can stay for a bit, thanks. Thanks, but I gotta go get going. Yes. Is anything thanks wrong, much. V? But I'd better be going. You're barely standing, V. How's it going? You take care of yourself, okay? Remember, our offer uh -huh. still stands. If you need help, the Aldecaldos are here for you. And that, at least, we can agree on. If you need anything, you know where to find us. Yes. Thanks, friends. Greener, thanks for the resub. Welcome back. How are you? Want me to walk with you? Ah, ah, follow. Avocado? What? Avocado? Hi, Cage. Welcome in. How you doing? I know this area. Back from the old roots. You really safe here, though? For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. And our vantage points really are much better. Hey! Welcome back to the land of the living! About time Thanks, Sleeping mate. Beauty decided to join us. Hey there. <laughs> he called me Beauty. But you know, everything here... It is temporary. All of it. We will soon have to decide what comes next. Yeah, you are nomads. <laughs> the 
kind of comes with a name. Ooh, there's the big boy. V, back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But I am serious. How can I help? Honestly, I don't know. Honestly, not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? He's the one who created the personality construct tech. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This Thanks. whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? Thanks, Panem. I'll be fine. You take care of yourself. Thanks. Thanks, Panem. My trusty roach. Doing good. I hope you're well, too. Yeah, I'm just a bit sleepy. I've been drawing the some of the Halloween-themed emotes until late in the night. And I'm not done yet. I need to do some more. All right, guys. I think... I don't know if this was literally the end of her quest line or... Um... You know, if there's more to come, but I think it, it, this is the end with her. So now we can do the Judy quest line, which personally is my favorite. Okay, let's see if we can get back to the city. Need to listen to Cyberpunk to start a petition. Well, the game is already done. I don't think they're gonna add more. Is there something like music? This is music? Okay. Although, I wanna- Oh shit, why do I always- <clears throat> Click F instead of R. Come back, car, come back. <laughs> uh, I'm always clicking- I'm holding F. <laughs> Actually, jump out of the car when I actually just want to hold R to bring up the radio again. Bloody hell. I want to see if... No. I just want to hear the Night City song again. I haven't heard that in ages. Go to Judy's like apartment. To hell yeah. I was planning on going myself, but I figured Not the no bloody point. news. I mean, after all... It's nothing but high quality. Strap in for acceleration. Silence, cool. That sounds pretty. <laughs> the trivia is F, yeah. We have a we have an F emote here. To go. Uh, the Night City song is playing on Body Heat Radio, by the way. I know, I know, but it was not playing at the moment, you know? And I don't want to listen to Pom Pom shit in the meantime. Guys, thank you for the first time sub. River. River? V. Hey. Yes. I need your help. What happened? Sounds like it. What happened? I shouldn't talk about this on the hollow. We gotta meet. When and where? Tell me. Glenn, tonight. I'll flick you the details. Will you make it? Do my best. Thanks, V. Sorry, Until Judy. Then. Sorry, Judy. But I said the best comes last. So I'll do his quest line first. Sorry, folks. Read the message from River. Meet me in the evening on the corner of Pacifica Boulevard and Market Street. All right. Did you play through Phantom Liberty already? Yes, now I did.
The Halloween emotes look really nice. Thanks, Katsuks. Uh, Dragorago, welcome into the stream. Meet with River Ward in the evening. Alrighty. So wait, Romans Panem as female? No. I thought she was only Romans able by the male. Yes. No, I didn't. I just did her quest line. I didn't Romans her. And even if I could, I wouldn't. This is the place. Tick, 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 tick. She said it four times, it was just three times in the subtitles. Oh, there he is. In the car. Hi, River. Hey, V. Hi. Hi, holding up. Been better. Oh. I know. Probably not hard to tell. Nice ride. Brand new? Nope. Not in a chatty mood, I see. Yeah, no. Not really. Sorry. Well then? So, what happened? Needed someone to talk to. Mm-hmm. First, take a look. Calculations have determined that you are listening to Hello, my name is Arif Iqbal, and this is WNS News. Today's story. A routine roadside inspection led the NCPD to the trail of a dangerous abductor and murderer. The incident occurred at the intersection of 7th and 15th Avenue. The following police footage was captured at the scene. 1038, I repeat, at 1038. Registration 2AA6244. We're exiting our vehicle now. Copy that. Out of the car. Hands up. Easy, officer. Relax. Shut your mouth. Oh, shit. Uh, we have a 1053 and a 1054. I repeat, a 1053 and a 1054. What am I watching the here? from the footage is Lavar Martinez age 17. His parents reported his disappearance over a month ago. Unfortunately, Lavar's life could not be saved. Oof. His body could not withstand the severe septic shock he suffered. Autopsy reports revealed the teenager was given dangerously high levels of hormones, anabolic steroids, and stimulants. Wow. The possessions and genetic material of seven other missing teens were also found in the car, belonging to one Anthony Harris. Unfortunately, their fates remain unknown. Although the criminal widely known as Peter Pan survived the gunshot, he has not regained consciousness, making interrogation impossible. Please stay tuned this to WNS Pan, News for developments in the story. Case you were looking for him? Never heard of him. Didn't cross my desk. What's the problem if they caught the guy? My nephew, Randy. He disappeared not long past. And what you just saw, the kid was wearing Randy's shoes. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck me. Asaka, thank you very much for the first time sub. Thank you, welcome to the chonkies. Guys, please welcome the first time subscribers with some chonky chonks. The disappearance, tell me more. Randy's disappearance. Know anything else? My sister and I don't get along that well. I don't know much. Just wish I could have been there for her when she needed it most. What, they figured you'd get emotional and kept you off the case? More like a restraining order. Won't let me anywhere near it. What? Gonagle took the lead on it. Lazy ass gonk. And so far, he ain't accomplished shit. Alright, so we do it. Wouldn't let it go if I were you. No way I'd let this lie. I know. And that's why I'm asking for your help. So what do we need to do? Can't interrogate the guy because he's a veg, but... We can view his dreams. Sorry, dreams? You heard me. Come on, I'll explain on the way. All right. It's an There's experimental procedure, but it's already yielding results. 
They record dreams that can be played back as PDs. Got access to these dreams? Got access to these dreams? Not yet. But they keep them in the lab we're headed to now. All right. There's this movie that this reminds me of um, with Jennifer Lopez. There's this uh, serial killer who kidnaps women and then, you know, does things with them. That doesn't matter right now, but um, she is like a psychologist. Oh, psych yeah, I think she's a psychologist. And there's this procedure where she's like linking okay. to his dreams, to his body in coma. Not exactly. We'll go in together, but uh, not through the main entrance. Oh, we're gonna break the law. We'll find a different way in and then hustle out quick. <laughs> Never actually been here, so I'll need your help. Oh, we gotta break the law. Oh my. <laughs> Find a way inside the lab, okay. The cell is the movie, nice. Yeah, the segmented whores, mm-hmm, yeah. It's a, it's actually a pretty good movie, I think. It's very messed up, but I think it's a, it's an interesting uh, approach. Wow, you need 20, and how lucky am I that I have 20 technical ability. All right, find a way inside the lab. In the okay, temple. shouldn't be anyone inside. The lab's in the middle of an audit, so make all the noise you want. How are we gonna find this brain dance? Look for a room where they edit the dreams of autistic kids. Oh, and remember, Peter Pan's real name is Anthony Harris. Okay, Anthony Harris. Use Kiroshi to find the right cabinet. They definitely don't store any BDs in this area. No, no, no. Small step for science, a giant leap for humankind. Important, all staff, please read. Decisions for next Locked. quarter. Can't get in. Um. HX, thank you for the two gifted. Enjoy the sniper rifle. Fatalis, thank you very much for gifting a sub. Appreciate you. Now we're not, we don't need to look in the mirror. We know V's is looking very pretty. We've got some kind of shard, but it's blank. Keep looking. Looks promising. <laughs> Hot top. Okay, let's go. I just want to see if there's anything that it uh, triggers. Any site information. Without me actually reading all of it. I know I'm very lazy. But I would be taking forever to read all of this. Maybe? Anonymous things as well. Candles. That is one chunky candle. Holy moly. Wow. Oh god, this is kind of messed up. Like a kid's room. So they can observe them. Close as well. Heart poisoning. Gosh, I lost my bearings. Hey, hungry. Oh, I've already been here. Oops. I 
out of space, my life in orbit. Anything in here? Ducky giving game and gameplay tips. <laughs> We're just looking for one of those storage cabinets, right? Yeah, probably not this way. There's a few here. Bloody doors. Nah. Definitely not in the bathroom. I'm pretty certain of that. Is there anything in here that I could open? No. Gosh, I get I'm, I'm getting all woozy from like running around and turning so quickly. Matrix, thanks for the two gifted. Enjoy the sniper. Jeez. Hmm. Novel phobia, blah, 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 blah. Okay, this is a dead end. Oof. Maybe it actually is in this big room with lots of cabinets inside. Are you looking close to where I need to go? Can I not jump? Cannot jump over. Hmm. Hmm. What a Gerald move. Hmm. Taking the Eddies. Maybe I was supposed to read something in this area. Brain dance, conditioning, and seropsychosis. <laughs> hmm. Do you want a fun fact regarding that place list? Uh, is it spoiler ish? I think I got it. Found something? Not yet. Anthony Harris. Let's try these drawers. Say, River, why not just have a janitor crack a door for you? Can't risk getting scolded for sniffing around somebody else's River. case. Yoan! What are you doing here? You got kicked off the force. Just suspended, actually. Oh! What did she mean by that? He hasn't told you? Yawen, please, listen to me. Aren't you in enough trouble already? Harris kidnapped my nephew. Probably. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But we store evidence here. And we have strict protocols. <gasps> protocols? Talking about his nephew's life here. A child's life. This is an ongoing police investigation. Go, please. Can't leave without Peter Pan's Get world. Get out now! Can't leave without Peter Pan's dreams. I'll say it one last time. Out! Damn it, Yawen. Who the fuck do you think you are? Remember your first med school exam? You know the one. 
Past it with flying colors. Gotta remember it. Ladies room erupted in flame. They evacuated everybody for two hours. I cannot believe you would throw that in my face. I never wish to see you here again. Especially you. This man, he only takes. He never gives anything back. Barely know, River. We just work together. Do not believe any promise he makes. Good tip, thanks. But we're wasting time. Harris is dream beady. Where is it? He isn't dreaming. What? What? Why? Lady, talk. Hi, Tumpy. A bullet damaged hey, his Robert. cerebral cortex. We get only dissonant urges. Pieces. I want to see for myself. I'd like to try audiovisual stimulation. But he isn't on the spectrum. A favorite song or movie helps you reach the kids. Might be worth a try. I am aware of the similarity. Hypothalamus stimulation and hormone production. But Harris is not a child. I have never tried the procedure on an adult. Any reason why? Any reason you haven't? Oops. <laughs> because unlike River, I went to med school and studied neuroscience. And not by reading about it over someone's shoulder on the metro. Let's try it. We don't even know his preferences. I'll find something. I mean you're willing to try. Just go. I'll open the front door for you. Let's ride, V. I know exactly where to start. What do you know about Arasaka's relic? Say, by the way, what do you know about biochips? Arasaka's relic, in particular. Well, it's designed to store a person's neural engram. Uh, sorry. Just imagine copying over a person's memories and personality. Right, I get that. I'm more curious what happens if the stored engram overwrites the engrams of the chip carrier. Overwrites? I... I'm not even sure that's possible. Why do you ask? Nah, never mind. <laughs> not a big deal. Thanks. Hi. Casually grabs coffee. It was an accident. <laughs> Just like, is it, is it your coffee? <laughs> Mine. <laughs> Return to River's car. Where, where's the car? There. Why does my double jump not work sometimes? I don't understand. You need to relax. Ah! Welcome in, cookies. Ask him for a friend, yeah. Did you, do you know anything about the relic thing from Arazaka, perchance? For asking for a friend. <laughs> You're to jump, did you okay. double jump? Wow. Let me hear it. Booted off the forest, didn't tell me you got fired. Lost your badge. Didn't tell me about it, why? I don't know. Makes you a bit of a lead head, doesn't it? Yeah, that'd do. <laughs> it's just, uh, it's not easy for me to talk about what's biting in my ass. Fair enough. Could tell me where we're headed, though. To Joss's. Randy's mom. She thinks he just ran away from home. For now, keep the kidnapping between us. Okay. Should we just be looking for Harris's place? I haven't mentioned Randy's dad. Tell me more about Randy. Tell me about Randy. What kind of kid he is. Petty theft, drugs, running away from home. That kind. Top uncles really see the best in you. There are people who always find their way into trouble. Randy's one of them. Shouldn't we be looking for Harris's place? Gonna tell me why we aren't trying to find Harris's apartment? It's a house, and I doubt he's keeping his victims in his basement. <laughs> and besides, we are trying. Want to see if we can find some connection to Harris at Randy's. Pretty weak lead. Best we can hope for just now. Yawen not gonna report you, you think? I'm not worried Yawen's gonna toe the line. Rat you out to her superiors. Used to be friends. Doubt she'd do that. Ooh. 
loss. Not that I'd use it. But I do know one skeleton she'd prefer remain tucked in her closet. Mm-hmm. You think she'll help? I think Yawin will actually help us, all things considered. Yeah. These tiffs of ours always end up the same way. I'll tell you about it over a beer sometime. <laughs> okay. Thanks for the gifted subs, guys. Let's focus on finding Randy. Sign me up for that beer. Uh, I would focus on Randy. Really out of focus on finding Randy now. Of course. Like, time could be of the essence here. Okay, skip the right, let's go. All right, this is it. It's sure been a while. I used to come over every weekend, a long time ago. And changed it all since? Places like this never change. Hmm. Nice. Looks pretty good. Lovely neighborhood. Mwah. <laughs> oh, Johnny. Simulates the freshwater environment of the Amazon basin from the mid 21st century. <laughs> Joke via my nine year old does a. Um, how does a mouse feel after it has showered? Squeaky clean. <laughs> Cute. River. You either got business with me or news about my Randy. Wouldn't drag your butt out here if you didn't. Joss, meet V. Hi. So V, is this about my Randy? Randy's been taken. Why didn't you call? Joss, I... Uh... Throw a blanket over the truth, like always. Guy who did it got caught and needs to prepare for the worst. We hope Randy's okay, but you ought to prepare for the worst. V, hey, please. Where's my Randy? We don't know that, but we're trying to find out. Yes. Then why are you here instead of searching for him? Arguing won't help. I'm not gonna say that. Just, just gonna piss her off more. Need to look through Randy's stuff. Listen, we need to look through Randy's things. Why? To find any lead we can. Trust me, Joss. Just don't destroy anything. Of course not. Randy doesn't like it when anyone pokes through his stuff. Let's go, V. Does any teenager? The kids are playing outside. Tell him it's time to eat. Okay. More kids? Joss Kutcher. Greetings from depression. Uh oh. I was 15 years old, set to fail four of my classes at school, but I could barely get out of bed, much less drag myself to the bathroom and take a shower. At first, my parents were worried, treating me gently, but after a few weeks, their patience began to run out, and that's when it started. Snap out of it. Just go for a run, you'll feel better. Why don't you talk to your friends? Quit feeling sorry for yourself. What do you have to be sad about? Other people have it worse. Words that, even after 10 years of therapy, medication, and stint in a psych psychiatric ward, and many, many relapses of depression, still ring in my ears. Anywhere, anytime, every day, and they still cut just as deep. Oh, is it her room? Pack of cards. Guess that's her room, huh? Bathroom. What's on your mind? I think all the women in your life have character. That's the trailer. Eyes peeled for details, eh? <gasps> Kiddos! Uncle River! Monique, Dorian. Hey, guys. Is this your girlfriend? Just a friend. Hi. Thank you for the sniper. Hey, thank you very much for the for the gift stay itself. Over? We'll a great see. day. Your mom's waiting for you with dinner. So you gotta turn around. Why are you so sad? Oh, 
Oh, he had his own trailer? That's cool. This is their old trailer. Randy moved in when I bought him a new one. Real hellhole. Like in my good old days. <laughs> you check around. I'll check the trash. I found a key. Got some kind of key here. For a car? A fossil. Not quite what we're looking for, no. Get high at home. Look for clues. Record player. Randy's guitar. And a six string. Randy's not gonna miss his eddies, is he? <laughs> Tainted Overlord. Favorite band. You know him well. I used to send him an album every year for his B-Day. Aww. Computer? What the heck? Randy had the scratch for this? You're joking. Some kind of game here. Shipping code on it. Chance Randy could afford hardware like this. Way too pricey. Do your mother departs? I think that's not written by him. And we gotta get in. But I doubt anyone knows the password. Can you crack it? Yeah, I'll try. Let's Why don't try. I give it a shot. Um, where do we have the BD? Okay. What? No, what? What? No, I think Don't I missed. How, River. No, no, I misclicked. I did a, I did a brain fart. No, let me try again. Sorry, I was like, still thinking about something else. <laughs> then I clicked. Oh. oh man, the days after twelve-hour stream, brain never really works. We gotta get in, but I doubt anyone knows the password. Yeah, yeah. Can you crack it? I'll try. <laughs> well, let me give uh, it a shot. Uh, I don't. It's one line, like, I have to do this in one go. This. There you go. Eureka. Help me scour this, will you? Sorry, Anthony to Randy. If they caught Harris in a vehicle like that, I meant to call. Sorry, spent half the day. Street. Shit, River, I remember that day. I meant he lives close to an old school. I meant to call, sorry, spent half the day sitting in my Thornton. Police had all of Watson blocked off and I was stuck in traffic for hours trying to cross town. I kind of live in an area where I used to go to school, but it looks all different now, so trying to find ways past all those jams made it easy to get all turned around. Hope you're not mad? Hey, no problem. I need to help my mom anyways, etc, etc. Do you have any everything ready for your place? Almost. Thanks. I just want to say thanks, guess in general, I'm just True holding- angel of empathy, this guy, huh? Onto the thought that there are more people like me out there dealing with the same shit. Why are you helping us anyways? It used to be like you, like all of you. I wasn't spared any of life's cruel twists and turns. Worst of it was when my best friend died. Shit, sorry to hear that. Can I ask what happened? 
Rare muscle disease. His body just got weaker and weaker until he was a shadow of himself. I wanted to, t I wanted to help him more than anything, but there was just no possible way I could. Of course, anyone who could help, he couldn't afford. If he just had the means, he could have bought some super drug or a new body or I don't know. Worse luck than the disease has being born was being born into a poor family. Anyway, that's why I do what I do. I could help my best chum. I couldn't help my best chum, but just maybe there are some people out out the world, out there. But just maybe there are some people in the world I can help. There. <laughs> Trouble in Haywood. Hey, I hope you don't mind, but figured out Randy's identity. Sent him the game as a present. I hope you don't mind. The one you found in his drawer. The same. Shipping code suggests the prick sent it from the Badlands. Hey, I hope you don't mind, but I used my admin privileges to find you in real life. That is your home address. Sorry, I hope it's not too weird, but I had a good reason. There's a gift on its way. A game called Big Trouble in Haywood. You know it? Anyway, hope you like it. Have fun. Creepy. Fucked up again. I'm taking again. I'm sorry, I don't Sky know why I keep doing it. Like I guess pro. I'm just a piece of shit. You're a perfectly normal person, Randy. You're just like anyone with a organic heart still beating in their chest. Remember, I'm always here to talk to, to understand you, to help you. I know you recover from this, like you always have. Natalie, thanks for yesterday. The city from up on the tower looked so beautiful. Honestly, I felt speechless. Though maybe that's just because I don't love heights. Really, it was nice. But maybe next time I take you into the city? Head to Japantown, grab a bite. You'll love it once you see it. And oh my god, the restaurant my aunt takes me to sometimes so nova. Just let me know. Love you, cutie. Yeah, of course. I have fun too. About this restaurant, we'll see. Not sure I'll have time. Hard to promise anything, so we'll see. Hey, you know you don't have to worry about Eddie's. We already talked about this. Just let yourself be invited to something nice for once. Love ya. Oh, sad smiley. What do you say? Tell you what. I think your side's really Nova. <laughs> do you? Are you... Seeing what I'm seeing? No. There's no way. Why would he do that? Let me read it. Not only did they agree to meet, but it looks like Randy was as excited as any kid on his way to a theme park. Fuck. This creep definitely scrambled Randy's head. Tell you what, I think your side's really Nova. I think I'm ready to finally meet up in person some time and place you wrote before. Because, man, I just can't wait now. Ah! That's right, same as we agreed. It makes me happy to hear you're happy. Just one tiny request, delete that first mail I sent, just in case. Don't want anyone sniffing around something that doesn't concern them. Family, I understand. I didn't have a normal family either. My mom died young and my dad, he just tried to give me a future. Wasn't easy though, to make a living in the farm once the cattle pestilence took hold. Eventually, it all just fell out beneath his feet. The cattle, the business, deep depression took his life. I tell you this so you know you're not the only one who's lost a father. I understand you so well. The only real difference is... Is it was... Difference is it was no mess that stole your dad from you. And for me, it was a corrupt corp and their dirty money grabs. That's why I hide all my activity from corps. Trauma team and Biotechnica would be all over me in a second if they knew what I got up to. But I don't have to explain all that to you, Randy. You get it. I know you'll keep all this just between us, Chumbas. Stay strong, buddy. I know you got it in you. It's pretty fucked up. Natalie must have been the only person Randy trusted. Can we view this page with a link? Yeah, in a bit. Hey, Nat, check out the side drugs are bad. When you're there, click on the image, the red one with the people in it. The hell is this? Some kind of cult? Like, how'd you even find this? Just crushing the net doesn't matter. You alive from Gale. Hey, you won't answer my text, won't answer my holo. Still alive, man? I have a special delivery for you from a Valentina Chum of mine. A Valentino Chum of mine. You just gotta pick it up. Anyone in Haywood would give both kidneys for this thing, and I'm still holding it for you, free of charge, like some gong. Do me a favor and answer, because I'm starting to get pissed. Alright, uh... Where's the link? Is it a file? Ugh, I hate this. Something deeply fucked about that cartoon. My skin's crawling. Ugh.
by Randy Kutcher. Wait, he wrote this? Volume 1 of the Blades of Doom Trilogy, Chapter 1, Ghosts of Ancestors. The silhouette of a gaunt female figure began to take shape among the ebb of the inky fog. By its long braid, the woman held a severed head. Only one eye socket clearly visible. Decay had already long begun to melt the face's flesh, exposing the white of bone underneath. The other side fared much better. Then, without uttering a sound, the woman shifted her gaze to pierce the eyes of the wary warrior. Come, kill me. I'm ready for death, she shouted with- oh, shouted. <laughs> with a cold intensity, prepared to meet her end at last. He wrote this. All right. Drugs are bad. Some kind of link. The one Randy wrote about? Let's find out. Never too late for change. Addiction can be defeated. Yes, to fight addiction. But he said click on the picture, right? Tony's shelter. A hidden page set up by Anthony Harris. Christ. Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Good to see you, friend. Welcome to Tony's Haven. The place you've been looking for. The place where you can become the best version of yourself. Thanks to Tony. I live here with my friends. They come here because they were fed up with seeing their life go to waste, just like you. Think of me as a farmer who looks after his livestock. Get acquainted and stick around. Together we'll show those old farms what we're capable of. No idea what I'm talking about? Don't worry. I explain everything in good time. But it's time for you to decide. Do you want to remain a shadow of yourself or become the person you always dreamed of being? Come on down. Uh, Jesus, River, this is fucked. A guy preyed on troubled kids, made habit to target boys like Randy. Shit. This is my fault. If I just paid more attention, just talked with him more. Hey, come on. You're not the one at blame here. I know who you are. You're the boy that's been rejected by society, left to fend for himself, misunderstood by his family and deprived of real friends. I was once like you. You can stay here as long as you like, because you just found your new home. I have a secret, special treatment that'll not only get you back on your feet, but will also free up that weight from your mind and shoulders, make you limitless. Everything you need to bust out of your shackles, you'll find them in my haven. You'll become superhuman. Resistant to sickness, strong, healthy, invincible. But before we do that, how about we get to know each other first? Shoot over a message to Anthony, blah, 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 drugs are bad, pub. Remember, you're one of the chosen ones. All right, go through Anthony Harris' hidden message. Have I not done that? There was a file here. Deleted, it looks like, but the name's still there. At card video. That name. Wasn't the video file on Randy's comp called something like that? Yeah. This. Hey, look. The name of this cartoon matches the missing file on Harris's page. That's what we needed to find for Yawin. V, we've got it. Randy must have downloaded it. Sure, but V, don't you get it? This could be the key to Harris's mind. Mm -hmm. Here's hoping. Hey, uh, can you use any of that Netrunner magic to shake anything else out of this? Nope. Like the skills for this. Not that kind of magician. Oh, okay. We'll have to manage without it. I fear, yeah. What was it, intelligence that I needed? Yeah. That cartoon, River, could be what we've been looking for. Said yourself we need something that'd get Harris to dream. Send it to Yawin. Right. Sending it now. Okay. Says she'll get back to me by morning. And that I am a son of a bitch. And, uh, <laughs> Come on. Let's grab a bite. All right. I'm hungry. Let's go. Follow river. What's this? I I got this key already. I already picked it up, didn't I? What's with the door? Listen, let's yeah. not worry Joss more than we need to, huh? We're hot on the trail. We'll know more tomorrow. That's it. All right. Why don't you do the talking? I just shut up. 
Hi Dabu, welcome in. Hi Spider, -woo. hi Cormie, welcome in. Dorian, please. But it really tastes like booger. Joss, we're finished. All done. Off to bed then. We left some for you, Uncle River. Thanks, Mike. Don't forget to brush your teeth first. Tell me you found something. No more tomorrow. Well, no more tomorrow. I sent some evidence to the lab. There's a chance we could know where to find Randy by morning. When's the last time you ate? Yesterday. Have mine. I'm not hungry. Thanks. Maybe later. Now you? No bullshit. Don't look at my brother, just tell me. Will you find my boy? Can't promise you anything, Joss. Except that we'll do our best. Yeah. You'll do your best. I'm sorry. <laughs> I understand her pain. Joss, you mind if V takes Randy's trailer for the night? No. Sure. Stay in, right? You gotta help me see this through. To the end. Of course. Of course I'll stay. Yeah. Find your way, all right? Yep. Gonna go hit the sack soon. Stay strong. Hang in there, Joss. Can't be easy, raising three kids on your own. Well, it wasn't any easier with my husband. Oh. In fact, the best days were when he didn't come home. There were times I wished he'd disappear for a month, just to not have him hang around. Was he that bad? That bad, huh? His bike in the highway. That was his world. But at home... Let me tell you a story. This one time he took Dorian into the city. Had some errand to run, just father and son. He came back that night, dead ass drunk. Raging at me for calling the cops on him. Did you? River found him in some dive and brought Dorian home. Oh god, poor kid. How'd he die? How'd he die? Thale de Caldos told me he died an honorable death. Whatever the hell that means. Well, they showed me his body, where his face used to be. Couldn't see the honor in that. Oh, shit. So, are you relieved now? Must have been a relief then, when he left. Left. For weeks, I cried every night. My husband was killed, the father of my children. I, I, I'm sorry. Randy changed. He locked up. Not to mention the other two I still had to raise. Life was rough with him and without him. Sometimes there's no solution. Thank, thank you, Arvons, for the two gifted subs. Enjoy the sniper. Hi, Lopez. Rainix, hello. Hey, Siege. V, Physics, wake up. Cycle. Not done sleeping. <laughs> Yawin called. It worked. The cartoon. Oh, nice. He's dreaming. Let's go. You got the BD? Right here. Slot it in. Jack into the computer. I want to see it on the monitor. Why do... Okay. Well then. That docky yours is quick. Not bad. What's the matter with you, Anthony? I have to report this. I hope you understand that. This isn't normal behavior. Anthony, 
You killed Liam's turtle. He was sick. He wouldn't eat, stayed in his shell. I just wanted to help him. By injecting him with HGH? What were you thinking? Is this something your father taught you? Good people took you in, extended their trust. This is how you repay them? Your friend died. I understand. But that is no excuse. Fuck you. What did you just say? The F word and you. Okay, I've had enough. Principal's gonna hear about this. Your foster parents, too. I see. Like father, like son. Oh. Uh, that was not necessary. Don't you dare talk about my dad! That's right, you little shit. I know it all. Farm failed, dad put a bullet in his head. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You can't talk about my dad, you... you prick! Oh. You... you can! You... you can! He... he was sick. Weak. I just wanted to help him. Um... Okay. Uh, the guy turned into a cow. Interesting dream. Wait, do I need to start from the beginning? What's the matter with you, Anthony? Am I not scanning him? Scan for clues. I have to report this. I feel like it. Something that I can see the entire time. There you go. Teacher. Cheap, well worn Night City in mid 2040s. We go back there and look, one of the kids has a mask thing okay. on, too. I have had enough. Really? Huh, I recognize this shooting. It was a case study back at the academy. Give me a sec to check which school that was. Laguna Bend. Uh, looks like the whole town got flooded in the 50s. Well, at least we know the general area where Harris lived. Guess that'd be that. What is he seeing? Trophy, old one. Dating from 2042, first place in an interscholastic wrestling tournament. Don't you dare talk about my dead head. That's right, you little Exit shit. the brain is proceeding to the next section. Far fail. All dead right. In his head. Shut up, shut up, shut up! You can't talk about that was the cow level, guys. Move. Tony, where are you going now? Come here. Uh -oh. Coming. Tony, come here. Yeah, Dad. You forget something? Yes, sir. Oh, I asked God. you a question. I I don't know. Choline, I'm at thy nine levels. See anything odd? Um. Too low? You were supposed to check before school. What do you gotta say for yourself? Cow's gonna die because of you. Gotta kill it like you killed your mama. I... I'm sorry. Don't apologize. Just dial up her hormones. And shut off that goddamn cartoon! How many times I gotta tell you not to leave it like that, hmm? 
Half the day I spent trying to turn that shit off. That poor kid. Okay, he's seeing shit. Let's go back to the beginning. Tony! Where are you going now? Harris looks even younger here. Am I supposed to scan the cow or? See that? Cow's sick, like the rest. Mm hmm. That's the father. Uh, got no way to ID him. Kid's father was a real hard ass. Uh huh. Looks like a cattle bio scanner for checking vitals. This quest was well done, but really fucked up. But I like that they show that. Criminals or messed up people or whatnot. They're not they're not born. They they're made Most of the time Cattle injectors for hormones antibiotics people ate meat loaded with this shit New Sam thanks for the first time sub on my channel enjoy the emotes and make them myself welcome to the chunkies guys Please welcome them. Oh, sorry No, what's this? Supplements in the feed for disease-free livestock. Look at the clues to help find Randy. Exit the brain dance. Is that the same farm, but just like changed? Oh god, this is creepy as hell. There's a lot of bodies. Am I limping? Oh god, there's some person trying to escape. Oh shit, man. And where are you up to, Mike? Come here, you rascal. You'll hurt yourself. Tony will take good care of you. Easy now. Ugh. That is messed up as hell. I think this might be the place to be. Got some cables. It's a recent memory. Gotta be his hideout. I mean, yes. 
Definitely. Got a clock. An hour to midnight. Looks like Peter Pan turned this farm into a goddamn final bastion. Must have been an auto shop or something here at some point. Mm-hmm, so it's not the same farm. Let me hear... What can I hear here? Hearing what I'm hearing? Trash barge. That's the signal to dump. Has to be a landfill nearby. Okay, that helps with the search. Right, what now? Oh, fuck me. Treats the kidnapped boys like cattle. Oh, shit. What's this? Infusion Machine pump. controls an injection system for stimulants, hormones, something. What am I not seeing? Look, another one. Oh god, do I have to scan all the people now? Fire department search stamp right here. City South. Perfect. Don't see Randy anywhere. Terminal controls the pens. Gotta be another deck somewhere for the mines and turrets. Oh, shit. Uh... What happened to your leg? Ugh. Ow. Oh, man. Scan for clues. I'm looking, I'm looking. Signage on the farm model points to Petrochem. He reminds me of the uh, creepy things in Amnesia the Dark Descent. They walk the same way, like with one leg being a little limpy. Ugh, creepy as hell. Can I see anything? Uh huh. Hey, the Illuminated Towers. Promoting the Us Cracks album that came out then. Colors changed every hour. I think that might be it. Nice. Get him him. Get him him. Steve, thanks for the two gifted okay, subs. So where do we sit now exactly? We know Harris still lives near an old school that's now underwater. You can see the NC skyline and the Us Cracks Towers from the farm. It's a few miles out. We go there Farm's now. Farm's located near a landfill. We know that too. Shipping code on the game Randy got from Harris traces out to the Badlands. Those towers promoting the Us Cracks album. Colors change regularly, once an hour. So we know the time. Eleven at night. Right. And that puts the farm east of the city. Southeast, actually. Stamp on the NCFD certificate was from the southern region. Farm models a petrochem design, so that eliminates any others. Which narrows it down to Edgewood Farm. That's gotta be our place. So... We All right, detective. It. Just hope we didn't fuck it up. Come on, we gotta go. Hell yeah, let's. I'm really glad CD Projekt Red didn't hold, don't hold back on some of their quests like this one and the crucifixion. Yeah. They do really good with that. And uh. Akashi, hello, welcome. Or oh, Akahi? How did you get your face to look like that with the cyberware? Makeup. Damn it. Let this work. It's gotta work. Focus or you lose it. 
Don't get distracted. We've gotta focus on the road. Yeah, easy for you to say. That's my nephew out there. We'll find him, River. <sighs> if I'd only known sooner how he felt. What was eating at him? This isn't your fault. I'm his uncle, V. And I wasn't there for him. Yeah, but... Fuck! Should I drive? Let's skip that. Let's get there fast. Oh wow, that was the fastest Grab something. turn ever. Oh, shit. All right, calm down. River, calm this down. is the farm. We got it. I know. Let's get the farm quick. Do you see how many explosives there are? Holy shit. Find a way into the barn. Gosh, he's paranoid as hell. Understandably so, but, you know. Anything interesting here? Manipulation easier than you think. Oh, wow. Undermining. Oh, God. This is so creepy. Like, he really... He really read up on how to... Like, groom them and... Manipulate them and... Ugh. It's gotta be here. Have a look around. Find a way into the barn. Find the farm security control system. Probably in here? No. I can help you, it's all real. Don't worry, fantastic news. We got cables coming out of this wall. Oh. Try disabling the defense system, then haul ass to the barn. Tinker Bell. <laughs> nice. Uh. Uh. Which one first? Local network. Fuse off. Uh, no. Wait. Um. Surveillance system off. Is there something different here? No. Alright, find a way into the barn. Let's go. Oh god, please don't make me fuck this up. Please fin let me find this kid alive. Why is this so bright and green? The hell? I kind of want to see if I can- oh my god, do you see how many explosives he's, pl he's placed? Shit, man. Oh god. Damn it. Locked up tight. Need to find another way. I'm scared of, like, blowing up and it look- oh my god. V, this- get down! What? Damn what? Right behind you! What are you? What? Do you freak me out? Don't do that! <laughs> Don't scare me like that, River. 
fucking hell. There was literally nothing behind me. I had a little heart attack. Come here, quick! He's already inside. River, wait for me. You're gonna get yourself out. You're gonna get yourself killed. Oh, climb on V, come on. Oh, fuck. We found him? Is it him? He's hanging in there. We made it. V, shut down the machine. Cannot link Randy otherwise. Randy! 1052. I repeat, I've got a 1052 at a farm south of the city. Yes, send the fucking squad! Yeah, we're laying coordinates now. No, several, at least. Do it quick, damn it! Oh, and oh, watch gosh. for automated defenses on site. They're substantial. But why would he do this? Can we free more? Make it go boom. Can we free more people? Or is everybody else dead? Return to river. Oh god, okay. There doesn't seem okay, to be anybody all else. Okay, disconnected. Check the others. Could still be alive. All right, all right, all right. right. Where? What can I do? Where? Here. Easy there. You're all right now. God. Oh God. Been dead a few days already. Hey, help me with Brandy. What? Hang on. It's okay. Don't don't be scared. We're here to help. Be right a back. Bit dehydrated, but you are gonna be fine. V, help me with Randy. What's going on? <laughs> Fuck! We need gorilla arms. <laughs> Third time's the charm. <laughs> Randy. Are you fainting? Why does your nephew look like a 40 year old? <laughs> I mean, drugs, okay, but <laughs> wow. We did it, River. We fucking yep. did it. We sure did. But I'm not about to leave it like this. The horror that bastard inflicted. Can't let it go. What's your plan? They napped him already. He's going nowhere. What's your plan? What are you want to do? Zero him? Exactly. Squeeze the life out of him with my bare hands. Sick fuck has to die. Don't do it, River. I'll help you. Do what you gotta do, but count me out. Don't do it, River. <sighs> River, come on, man. Won't change anything. Anthony Harris is a sad sack of meat hooked up to a respirator now. For how long? He has to die. Why? It's the only way I'll be sure. Stop. Gonna throw your life away getting revenge on a brain dead vegetable? Yeah, come on. No, I don't know. Maybe you're right. Yes. But it's driving me crazy not doing anything. We did something. We rescued people. They'll need you now. Actually. Got quite a bit you can do, River. Joss, Randy, the kids. They're gonna need you now more than ever. Yeah. No, you're right. Yes, I am. Forget about Harris and go on with your life. Forget about Harris. Take one day at a time. But rest first. 
Once your head's on straight again, give me a hollow. We'll talk. Yeah. Need a little time to myself now. But then I'll call you. I will. Hey, we're ready for evac. Are you riding along or not? Really, V. Thanks. Got you. Couldn't have done it without you. No problem. Don't be a stranger. Get a better jacket. <laughs> You advertise the site as a safe haven for young boys straight out studying manipulation, yeah. Oh god, what a quest. It's a good quest, but it's like a... Oh man, it's tough to play that. Just complete the hunt. Sheesh. Poor boys. All your years ever seen anything like this? Eight years in the force. Nothing comes close. Beyond twisted. Yup. That sums us up. And a better walk, Liz. He walks like something hurts. I mean, he's allowed to walk a bit weird. He's seen some shit now. Whew. Now. I fear, my friends, that Judy has to wait until Wednesday. Sadly. I would like to continue, but I don't want to stop in the middle of the quest with Judy. <laughs> River walks weird. When he walks the same way, like most of the males in this game, right? I think Takamura and Jackie, they all walk this, this way. Oh, look at this game. This is gorgeous. Pretty. Why is the area hostile? What did I do? Uh, fast travel point. Where's that? No, Angelus. But... I don't remember everything, you know. Go to Judy's apartment. Woohoo! Let's at least go there yet, already. Oh, oh my god, that, that rabbit backpack. Go to Judy's apartment. Oh, I so want to play more. I love this game so much, guys. Ah, it's so good. I think the storytelling is so amazing and the quest line. Typically, CD Projekt Red, super good. The characters are so nice and authentic and everything. And oh god, I just I just love this. But sadly, I really have to go, my friend. So I'm gonna save it here, and we will continue on Wednesday. And I hope I see you guys then.